It says Thursday the 28th of April and a day out at the Carterthon having a picnic. That's the White Carterthon there with the hill fort up there and this is a picnic area that is very nice and then looking over into Glen Lethnet that's Wern Hill in the distance that's the Wern, my favourite hill and going round to the Brown Carterthon that was the first settlement of the Picts before they moved to the White lovely day this is the signpost at the picnic area showing pictorially the white carterthon on the left and the brown carterthon on the right. It says they were built over 2,000 years ago and used by the Picts. There's a good path all the way up to the top of the white carterthon. Brown Carterthon, the path's a bit muddy. It's lovely here when the heather's out in August, September. Beautiful. There's a lovely view of Wern Hill there. That's the Hill of Wern. This is the view that meets you when you reach the top. This is the stone walls of the fort. I'll go into the fort and we'll see the size of it. That's looking along the walls of the fort to the far end. It's quite a size. I don't, know where the, don't know where the stones came from. The west water's quite a different distance down below me. And that's looking down towards Bridge End and Glen Lethnet itself. It's Glen Lethnet away up there and over to Wern Hill and the main road way back down to Edzo, over that way. This is the far end of the fort on White Catterthon. And this is the well area, just about the end of the fort. You can see the, the white walls of stone go right round. So they reckon it was built just over 2,000 years ago, inhabited by the Picts. This is a view looking back down the path towards the small car park, the cars at the bottom, and the brown carterthon just over on the other side of the road, the single track road that runs over into Glen Lethnet.